What you just heard in the intro is from my song Sweet September, which can be found on my album These Empty Arms. You can listen to the album in its entirety here on YouTube. It's also available on the major streaming services and is available for purchase on Amazon and the iTunes Store. I want to talk a little bit today about why I made this channel. I've been playing guitar for over 20 years, and while I played continually through that time, my passion for it was really reignited about five or six years ago when I discovered the YouTube videos of the Andertons guys, Rob Chapman, Phil McKnight, and then later on Tim Pierce and Rick Beato. And I also uh, really came to enjoy the Trade Secrets videos by Dan Earlwine of Stuart McDonald and learned a lot about guitar repair. And over the last several years, I had really have uh, had my knowledge increased so much by these and so many other great content creators that inspired me to share my knowledge and experience. And while I would never claim uh, to be a musician on the level of Tim Pierce or Danish Pete or Rob Chapman, and no one may ever know as much about guitar repair as Dan Earlwine, uh, I believe we all have unique perspectives to share. And I want to share the perspective of someone who despite having a great passion for it, because of the realities of life, is a part-time musician and works full-time. And while many of these channels provide great content, they're often playing in studios or special sound rooms and major music stores where they can crank up 50-watt, you know, 100-watt amps as loud as they want for the most part and really you know, go all out. And unfortunately for most of us, including me, that is not usually the case. Sometimes I get to gig and uh, play in louder settings like that, but usually I am playing at home, and as I like to say in my videos, at a volume that hopefully is not bothering my neighbors. And that is simply life for most of us. And I wanted to demonstrate my own personal gear, because nothing I have on the channel uh, so far is product provided and I uh, have no plans for that in the future. Everything I either purchased myself or received as a gift from family over the years for you know, maybe a birthday or Christmas, going back to when I was a teenager. So nothing is sponsored in any way. It is simply my thoughts on my own personal gear. And I believe that's a, that's a helpful perspective. And again, when you're listening to things on my channel, I always try to say what mic I'm using, what amp, uh, so you know what it might actually sound like in your bedroom or living room. And yes, I record with these guitars and these amps, and I'm uh, trying to share some of that as well, but I think that that's very helpful to know how these things sound in the settings most of us are usually playing them in. I have some uh, ideas for things I'd like to do in the future. For example, so far my most popular video has been my uh, in-depth review of the new Squire Classic Vibe uh, Custom Esquire in Lake Placid Blue. Recently Squire announced that there's going to be a new line of Affinity guitars. And I'm thinking of trying to pick up the Affinity Telecaster in Lake Placid Blue, shoot it out against the uh, slightly more expensive uh, classic vibe, and then hopefully use the affinity as the means of demonstrating some higher end pickups, maybe a new neck, a new bridge, and see how those elements improve what's in a very affordable guitar, and whether that's something for an experienced player uh, to think about, maybe buying a $250 guitar and putting $500 in parts into it rather than buying a $2,000 guitar. But uh, I'm hoping to do that down the road in the months to come. And I say months because, like I said, I have to pay for all this myself. And I already have a ton of guitars and uh, I have to justify being able to spend more, as I'm sure virtually everyone watching this can understand. So... I hope to share that and more content in the future. I'd like to share uh, some more reviews of my personal gear, some more of my own music. I'm working on some new musical projects as well, and uh, just my own unique perspectives. I uh, don't claim to be any type of virtuoso player by any means, and some of the things people on YouTube 
uh, demonstrate now is just amazing. Even you know people like Steve Vai are blown away by it. So I'm not at all trying to compete with people like that. I'm just trying to uh, share my music and my thoughts and my own perspective, and I hope that that uh, can help you all in some way. So I think a good example of that is what I'm going to play you out with. Last night I was uh, jamming along with some Anderton's backing tracks, and I just pulled out my iPad and decided to record some of it. So I know a lot of us aren't set up. Uh, I do have it to where it just takes me probably five minutes to get my gear set up to record, but that can take you out of the moment. So even though it might be a low production value, it uh, captured some of what I was doing in the moment, and that's what playing music is about for so many of us. So I hope you enjoy it. Please like and subscribe and hope to see you down the road. Mm -hmm.